morning guys welcome to another vlog um i want to vlog today because i'm getting my hair done so i wanted to kind of show you what it looks like right now it's super greasy so just ignore that it's just a lot of brown a lot of my natural hair color so i'm going to put more blonde in um i am going to a new salon i've never been there before but um i made sure to do my research and i found this girl on instagram um i'll leave her linked here well I'll leave her linked here if she did a good job. <laughs> I want to find someone who specializes in what I want. I feel like a lot of times we just go to salons and say like, hey, can you do this to my hair? And they don't have any idea or clue of what to do. So I wanted to make sure I found someone who was like a specialist. I just want to be my blonde self again. Um, it's been a while. It's been like eight months since I've been to a salon, which is insane, but I'm nervous that um, salons and things will shut down again. I don't know if it will, but um, yeah, so I just want to get my hair done before anything else happens so I can, you know, look at myself in the mirror every day and be like, you know, she's cute even though she's in sweats. I'll do a full before and after. Um, I don't know if I'll just like continue vlogging the rest of the day. Maybe it'll just be like a hair vlog, but, um, and I also don't know if I'm going to film in there. There's a lot of code restrictions still, obviously, so I don't know if I feel comfortable just like leaving my camera on somebody else's like... I don't know. I just don't know if I'm going to do it. But yeah, let's go get my hair done. All right, so I just got here. I'm just waiting. Um, I have to call in and um, let them know that I'm here, but it's still pretty early. So I'm just going to wait a little bit. And I also think I'm going to get some pizzas when I go home, like after my appointment. I might order, um, if there's like a really good pizza shop down here that I might just order. They do curbside pickup. So I'll probably just do that and we'll either have it for lunch or dinner or both. Yeah, so I'm just waiting. Like I said, I don't think I'll bring my camera in, um, but here's a final look at my hair in the natural light. Hopefully I'll be gorgeous and blonde after this whole thing. All right, guys, I just got out. It looks so good. I'll show you more at home because I have pizzas in the back that I just got, but I'm absolutely in love. I'm out of breath because I just like ran to get the pizzas and then I ran to my car and it's really flipping hot out. All right guys, I just got home and I just ate my lunch and this is the final hair, which I am so in love with. Um, like I was saying before, I feel like I've never left a salon and felt happy, which is so sad, but I feel like the majority of us have all done the same thing before. Yeah, so she did some foils. She did some like hand painted areas. Um, she also fixed the um, horrendous at home uh, highlights that I did. And I absolutely love it. If you are in the Natick, Framingham, Boston area, I'll leave her tag up here um, and I'll link it in the description down below if you're interested. Um, it's just a really, it's really cute salon downtown actually, um, but I'm so in love with it. I'm going to possibly shoot some content right now. Um, and then later, Colin and I are gonna go out. I wanna actually pick up some new shampoo and um, <clears throat> we're gonna start looking for Christmas decorations. Let's go like shoot some content and get ready. I figured I'd flash you guys my outfit today. I have this sweater from Revolve paired with a Banty from Princess Polly. Some thrifted Gap jeans and then my Converse. I decided to procrastinate and make myself um, an iced matcha. Hey, Colin. Did you really leave one ice cube in here? <laughs> Why? You didn't want to refill it? You just wanted to leave one ice cube? Yeah. Oh, anybody else's husband do that? But for this matcha, I did vanilla coconut creamer, vanilla coconut creamer with a little dash of maple syrup and some almond milk, and it's delicious. I literally started shooting content and completely forgot that I was vlogging, but um, this is my setup right now. Put up a new curtain. Got these curtains from Amazon. They're like velvet curtains. I'm um, actually using my dog bed because 
bright and colorful and he's not using it. Where is he? He's sleeping. He's always sleeping. <laughs> so I'm just shooting this Rick's of London dress. This bad boy here. I just completely stopped vlogging yesterday um, I just <laughs> I didn't have it in me so I figured I would just do like a little weekend vlog all right that's like a little better <laughs> kind of I'm just so pale oh my god um, but yeah the Target had some really cute decorations um, we're gonna check out like TJ Maxx today and Marshall's um, I might go to Starbucks and get a Christmas coffee uh, the caramel brulee lattes are like so good. I'm just gonna finish getting ready and I'll take you on like the behind the scenes again. I feel like a lot of you really like the behind the scenes videos that I do on my channel. So um, I'll show you the behind the scenes of my photos today and I'll flash you my dress before we leave. Um, it's a really cute, like, it's a really summery dress from Charlie Holiday, but I figured I didn't get to wear it this season because it got sent to me kind of like on the weird in between of the weather changing so I'm gonna shoot it today all right so this is the first look that I'm gonna shoot today it's this dress from Charlie Holiday and then I have my docks on so cute and summery and then the other looks that I have so I have this one so this is that um, mink pink jacket I just have one of my kiss tees and then there's some jeans under there and then I'm going to be shooting this NVLT jacket with just a white tee and some jeans. And then last, um, the Rixo London dress. I have this chain belt from Nasty Gal. I'll probably wear my docks with this. And then with these two, I'll wear these boots from ASOS. to start our day we're gonna go get some breakfast some really good um, bagel place that's near us and then get some coffees and then we're gonna go shopping for some decorations best bagel sandwiches that have ever graced this planet how is it good I am so sorry I've been so bad at vlogging this whole weekend it's pretty much just like a random vlog we just got back from taking my dog for a walk okay my dog is literally just gonna keep drinking his water. As I was saying, we just got back from taking our dog for a walk. Um, we still have to run a Target, which we're gonna do now. I'm not vlogging like in the stores. Today is just like super chaotic. I don't know what is wrong with people today, but like everyone's on another level, like Christmas shopping level. And I'm kind of confused. Everything Christmas is like in the stores, Black Friday deals are happening. I just want the world to slow down a little bit <laughs> because I just want to enjoy the season and like you're rushing me people. Anyways, we're gonna go to Target and then I'll show you all the decorations we got. Um, we barely got anything, so I'm hoping Target has some stuff for us. Um, after that, I'm just gonna finish organizing and cleaning because I actually bought some like organizing stuff. 
so I want to just make the apartment nice and clean. Um, yeah, so that's what we're gonna do now. And hopefully I come back and talk to you guys and I don't forget. All right guys, I'm a sweaty mess. We just got back from Target, so I want to flash you what I got. A lot of really, really cute Christmas decorations that they had, like super bright and fun. So I'm gonna show them to you. Hopefully it's okay, I'm in my hallway right now, so let me show you. All right, so I got this really cute like pink tree. I got some other decorations that I'll do like a Christmas decorating vlog. Um, some really fun sparkly bits. So bright and colorful. I love this little flamingo guy. Some reindeer, some dinosaurs. Got this guy, so cute. Obviously, can not give up on the animal print. And more dinosaurs, some glittery dinosaurs. This really cute like velvet tree. And then this velvet guy. I also got this funky little Christmas tree. I got some Christmas cards, and again, some more little trees. And then my last purchase was these amazing pillows for a couch because I've been looking for pillows everywhere. So I opted for these Opal House embroidered leopard print pillows. Oh, and I also got this Christmas calendar. All right guys, I'm ending the vlog here. Sorry it was all over the place. I promise the vlogs will be entertaining at some point in time. Hopefully, hopefully you're doing okay. Let's just say that. Hopefully you're okay. Hopefully your mind's okay. If you ever need help, DM me, comment, we'll talk. Life's hard for everyone right now. Um, yeah, so sorry this was all over the place. And I'll catch you in my next vlog. Bye!